I don't want to sound schizotypal. I don't believe that I am. I don't know what I am. I think I'm just exploring spirituality. I want this video to be quick. I know it's going to sound fucking crazy because a lot of you don't believe in the spiritual, but just hear me out. I used to contact demons. I used to consider myself a demonolator. It's called demonolatry. It's basically like that means you worship demons. You know, not to be confused with demonology, which is the study of demons. But yeah, demonolatry. Uh, like demon, then, and I, I don't know how to spell it, like A-L-T-R-Y, or I don't know how to spell it. Demon, demon, demonolatry. I don't know how you spell it. I forgot how to spell it. But I got, but I got out of that, um, kind of, not recently. Um, I kind of quit. I don't know when I quit, but okay, it doesn't matter. Because I noticed that. Not every time I con try to contact a demon, but when I try doing like rituals to honor certain demons and stuff like that, like sometimes when I tried like doing these like you know contacting demons or whatever, right? Um, sometimes I would notice that I would get sleep paralysis, like I'd feel like someone's choking me, like not even just sitting on my chest, but actually like choking me. And sometimes I would see like black shadows, like as I'm drifting off to sleep, I would see like a black shadow coming at me. There was, I'm not fucking, I know I have antisocial personality disorder and we tend to lie and shit like that. I'm not lying. I'm not, li I don't even believe I have antisocial personality. I think the doctor just slapped that on me. But I'm not lying when I say this. I'm not lying when I say this. As I was drifting off to sleep, I had this hallucination. And you can hallucinate when you're falling asleep or upon waking up, you can have both. You know? But as, as I was falling asleep, I saw this black shadow coming at me. And then as soon as I see it coming at me, I feel it pressing down. <laughs> Can't breathe, right? Again, this was around the time I was contacting demons. Ever since I stopped contacting demons, the sleep paralysis, the weird hallucinations, like the choking, like all that went away. That was like a couple of years ago. I stopped like a year ago or two years ago. People could be like, it's just medical. It's just medically explained. But if I truly had medically sleep paralysis, why did it go away coincidentally when I stopped doing the magic shit? That's why I don't believe it's a medical sleep. Yes, I have sleep apnea. But I, it's been a very long time since I had that. You're going to tell me it's a coincidence? That as soon as I stop doing that dark black magic shit, you're going to tell me it's a coincidence that, oh, it's just a coincidence of around the time you stopped contacting demons. I don't think it's medical. I don't give a fuck what you say. It, it was spiritual. It was 100% spiritual. I don't believe that. I don't believe that was a coincidence. I don't care what you say. Now, as far as are, are the Christians right I don't know. I, I'm not a Christian. I'm still kind of hesitant on that label, you know. Christianity is too rigid and strict for me. I wish, like, there was a religion that would let you just practice kind of, like, I wish there was, I want to practice multiple things. I just want to believe in multiple things. I know that sounds schizotypal, unconventional beliefs, but I just want to be unconventional, okay? So, yeah, I don't recommend contacting demons. I don't know if the devil exists, but I wouldn't recommend that evil, um, e evil. E I wouldn't recommend that e either, um, even though I've never had any really bad reactions to worshiping the devil. I used to worship the devil. There was only like one weird time where I, it wasn't Satan, but it was Ariman from Zoroastrianism where I was ready to contact him. This could be a separate video in its entirety, but I'm not, again, I have antisocial personality disorder. We tend to lie, but I ain't fucking lying when I say this. Um, I was ready to worship Ariman one time, and just when I was about to do it, I saw a spider on my wall, and it jumped halfway across the room, and it freaked me out. Now, okay, it could have been a jumping spider, but halfway across my room. It could have been a hallucination. I wasn't sleepy, though. Um, but it could have just, could have been just like a psychotic episode or something. Because ever since that spider dropped, jumped half, halfway across my room, I was not, I was never a able, never able to find it again. So, I don't know. I mean, it could be possible. Maybe it shot a web or something. 
and it looked like it was flying in the air, but really it was just walking in the air. I just couldn't see the web or something. I don't know. But yeah, I wouldn't recommend contacting demons. But I'm not telling you to go to Christ or anything like that. I'm not, I don't know if he is real. I don't know if God's real or anything. But I still don't trust in God. And I, I'm not a Christian. I, don't, I still don't trust in any of that stuff. You know what I mean? It's just... I'm definitely not into demons anymore. That's basically it.